Hello everybody, Charlie's Cards here. What a wonderful night it is because it's baseball card time. Yes, it is. And uh, tonight I bring to the table three 30 card value packs of Don Ross, 2020 Don Ross. Got the big boy on the front, your Don Alvarez from Houston, Texas. He's not probably not from Houston, Texas, but so this pack includes one vector and three halo red parallels per pack on average. And if you're under nine years old, you require supervision to participate in this activity of ripping and flipping baseball cards. So please adhere to no purchase necessary see back panel for and there's your uh i don't know write them and get a free pack of cards or something back panel oh probably under here under here so this would be all the odds too look at all this holy guacamole Wow, there's a lot of stuff in here. No purchase necessary. Huh, I've never done that. Maybe I should try that just for the heck of it. See what I get. <laughs> that would be uh, all that work just to get like a base nobody card. All right, so let's rip them. Let's flip them. So, these are the paper. There's no, uh, that one's damaged. Ho Andre Galarraga. Uh, oh, the, the good ones will probably be in the center there. So, not a bad looking card. So, we're looking for R Lou Rob and your Don and and uh, I don't know if Lewis is in this, so we'll just have to take them card by card and see. Actually, like this better than uh, than the tops 2020. So yeah, you can see the sparkly back there. All right, so that's Kevin Biggio's second year card. And there's the back of them. So it's got a little uh, insight into his career. It's got his numbers, his stats, and it's got his uh, height, weight, bats left, throws right. Bats left, throws right. Huh. Bats left. Yeah, that's batting left. Throws right. Hmm. That's unusual. All right. Lorenzo Kane, Milwaukee. So, uh, Panini, the manufacturer, Don Ross doesn't manufacture these anymore, and neither does Leaf. Leaf used to own Don Ross. Panini bought them, and Panini insists on making sports cards uh, in a lot of... Um, sports that they're not licensed to make sports cards. Uh, what that means is they can't have the team logos. Uh, they can't have the team names. So all they'll have is Milwaukee or Toronto. They won't have, they'll usually uh, have the p player turned in a way that you won't be able to see the front of his jersey. They'll black out any emblems that they have anywhere else on the picture. As you can see from Jordan, uh, same thing. So that basically means that they, they're not licensed by Major League Baseball to, uh, to do what tops can do. And with that comes a little bit different uh, of, of an instance of 
how the cards look, um, how the players look, how they compare, that kind of thing. So, Jonathan Villar, Villar, flip them around, and Brian Reynolds, I believe that's his second year card. Clayton Kershaw. Lucas Giolito. Josh Hader. I'm not familiar with these, so I don't know. I was looking on uh, I was looking on the Giolito for a rookie emblem. So I'm still looking for a rookie emblem on these. Trey Mancini. Ronald Acuna Jr. So you can see that uh, they pick they pick them. They pick the uh, they pick the pictures where the front of the player is not visible because that's usually where they have their team emblems and stuff like that on. So Ronald Acuna Jr. He's on the IL. Judge is on the IL. LeMahieu is on the IL. Eddie Rosario and a whole bunch of guys that normally don't tear it up are tearing it up. So, it's been an interesting year so far in baseball. I know it's short, but it's uh, been quite eventful. Go A's. All right. Yandy Diaz, Mitch Garver, and here's our first Diamond King. So, if you watch my video from yesterday, we were able to see the 1987 Diamond Kings. How far they've come. So this is number two. There's the back of those. Almost spit an image to uh, the Diamond Kings other than the front picture is uh, more of an artist, artistic character, caricature, uh, a, a drawing or a painting of the players, more like it. Okay, so these are these are the short prints or the the name variations. Um, that doesn't mean, let's not call it a short print. Let's just call it a name variation because there's, I think they do a lot of these. So, uh, in 18 and 19, I was saving them and then I would get more cards and the same ones would be in there. So I don't believe there are any, uh, any shorter of a, of a run, but, uh, I believe that's Altuve. Jose Altuve, okay, so what we're trying to do is identify what's going on, so if it's got a red uh, D with a baseball on the top, it's it's uh, a numbered, it's a, it's, it's a variation, let's call it, right? So that's a variation, that's a name variation, and again, we're looking for the red D on the top. Here's here's the normal one. It just has the Don Ross on the top with a number. Okay, so that's a Jose Altuve. Here is a rated rookie. Is that not still the same rated rookie they used back in the day, which is pretty cool? There's a Nick Solak, so that's not bad. He's doing well. Okay, so there's... Uh, Eugenio Suarez, he's, he's playing some decent ball. Anthony Gwynn, really? Why would you call somebody Anthony Gwynn? That's not his name. All right, so let's see. I, I guess this is like a different run. And my guess on these is that if the uh, if the baseball is black, then uh, then that's usually some kind of variation. So I would say his name variation again. We'll uh, we'll look at that one again and see. All right. So there's a body. And that, that has the red, so that's probably an image variation, I would have to guess. 
One good thing about tops is it would have a number down here on the bottom and you'd be able to tell exactly what it is. There's a Tony Gons Gon Gonsolin rated rookie with the Dodgers. There's a guy that's been pitching really well this year. Lance Lynn, Diamond King. And here's some of our... Uh, wow, look at that one. That's got a lot of color to it. That's Goldie. Paul Goldsmith with the St. Louis Cardinals. So, I don't know... If that's one of these, one vector. So, yeah, might be a vector. Vector. Not numbered, not numbered, not numbered. But it's a pretty card. All right. You Darvish. And this one is the Halo Red Parallel. New Darvish. Turn it around. Broussard Grotterall. Rated rookie. Red. Turn it around. Sandy Alcantara. Red. And then it will always have one of these, which is like a USA baseball, super duper, wow, boxy, crazy there, Austin Martin. And then in the back is Chipper Jones. Co Collegiate National Team, American Pride. All right, then we have some of the Don Ross. Rookie card, Sheldon News with the uh, Oakland A's. Turn it around, and we got an Eddie Murray. Baltimore. And we got a Logan Allen rookie card. And we got another good one here, a Danny Mendick rookie card. And then we got a Andreas Galarraga. Okay, so like we saw in that other one, where is that one? Uh, right here. This was the Anthony Gwynn. So that's what we're looking for, a black ball. Uh, a black baseball means that it's uh, a, a variation of some sort. Probably a name variation on that one again. All right. All right. Now that we know what we're getting into, let's dive into another pack. Yeah. Rip it and flip it and see what we get. Michael Conforto, Eloy Jimenez, Rai Hoon Jin, flip her around, Vladimir Guerrero, Jose Altuve, Madison Bumgardner, Xander Bogart, flip her around. John Means, Luis Arise, Jack Flaherty. This is a good pack so far. I feel the Lou Rob coming on. David Peralta, Carlo G. Car G. N. Carlo Stanton. Interesting first name. Geo Carlin. Flip her around. Here we go with our variation. Red. Alex Bregman. So the two the two uh, 
short prints we got were both Astros. And we got a rated rookie of Mauricio Dubon with the San Francisco Giants. I've watched him play. I've obviously I've been following Yaz. He's tearing it up. Uh, honoring his grandfather by playing great ball. And uh, I've seen Dubon play. Not, not. So, rated rookie. There's a Paul Goldsmith Diamond King. And there's the back of that. Diamond Kings. Turn it around. This will probably be our variation. Yep. Travis Timothy... Demerit with Detroit rookie card. And a rated rookie of Yushitomo Tosugo. Oh, I got through that. That's a miracle. Rated rookie. And a rated rookie of Jordan Yamamoto. Uh-huh. Lucas Giolito, Diamond King. Another Paul Goldsmith. Variation. So, action variation, probably. That will go in the action variation. Okay, so there's a Bo Bichette. There's a Bo. Bo knows. Bo knows baseball. Bo, Bo is, is making himself the, uh, the hot product on that loaded Toronto lineup. So all you, congratulations, all you Bo collectors. Um, last year, late 2019 uh, rookie stars, he, uh, he is showing himself. To be a ball player. So again, a position player, um, batting good, hitting good. So I don't got that one. So that's cool. All right, now we get into the red halos. There's a red halo of David Fletcher. Really sparkly. They. About what they're, what uh, Don Ross is about is the sparkly ones. So, another Travis rookie card, and an Aaron Chevalier, and boom! Look at that pretty card. The rookies. If you watched my video last night, we just opened up a pack of that. Uh, we did get an answer. It was supposed to come in a box. So I went on eBay, and sure enough, it was supposed to come in a box. So I ordered another one and paid about half as much as I paid for the Mark McGuire. So Mark McGuire's on the front because it's number one. So I thought I'd get a seal package of it, which is pretty cool. But look at this. It should be numbered, too. Come on. Where's my numbers? No, but, boy, that's a pretty Ordon Alvarez. Those boxes are really cool. All right. Well, let's put that one right in a top loader. And call that one a hit. Boom. All right. I know we got a few more here. I've watched this man pitch too, Adbert Ozile, uh pitching tonight for the Chicago Cubs. So if you got uh, MLB Network, the Cubs are playing the Cardinals, I believe. And Ozile is pitching. There's uh, the Ryan Express. Jake Fraley with the Seattle, so I've heard of him. There's a Barry Larkin. 
And there's a Donnie Baseball. Don Mattingly, who is now uh, a manager. Or was it the Marlins or the Rays? I'm not sure there, but I know it's one of those teams. Rip it. Flip it. Let's see what we get. It looks like Mikey's on the front. Look at that. Mikey's on the front. It was a crazy event. Uh, not what, yesterday when they were trying to throw at Mike Trout. thought that was interesting. He, he, uh, he, he maintained his, uh, his composure. So that's good. Come on in. Mike Trout. And there's uh, Mike Sirocco. Christian Yelich. He's starting to get back on track. There's a 2019 rookie, Nick Sinzel. Aaron Noah. There's, uh, there's my PC, Cody Bellinger. He's starting to pick it up now. There's Max Kepler, Manny Machado, and uh, Fernando Tatis Jr. Jr.'s tearing it up. They were yelling at him for hitting a grand slam. Like, wow. If you haven't heard that, if you haven't seen that, Google that. Why he got yelled at for hitting a grand slam. Oh, there's Gonzalez Marco. And Trey Mancini. There's another Ronald Acuna Jr. There's an Eddie Rosario turning around. And there's our first variation. And that's the red. And that is a name variation of the polar bear. Pete Alonzo. All right, so let's put that in the variation pile. And here comes the rated rookies. It's on Diaz. Marcus Simeon with the Oakland Athletics. Flip her around and see Logan Allen, Cleveland. And that's the black baseball. So that is uh, probably our image variation. And below that is, boom, Lou Rob. Lou Rob. <laughs> wow. All right. Lou Rob showed up. Last pack magic. So the way it looks right now, I think uh, Kyle Lewis is going to smoke him for uh, for the uh, Rookie of the Year. So, let's see. Chicago White Sox and the Chicago Cubs. So the Cubs are National League. So that must mean that the Chicago White Sox are AL. And Seattle is AL. So that would mean that they're competing against, they're competing for uh, the Rookie of the Year. Because if you recall last year, the winners were the Polar Bear in the National League and Jordan Alvarez in the American League. All right, Logan Webb. So rated rookie. I uh, pulled this one. I was like, man, those guys almost look, don't they look the same? Thought they were like the same. Logan Allen, Logan Webb. Okay. All right. There's Josh Bell. 
pretty much designated hitter for the Pirates now. Eloy Jimenez. So that's some type of variation. Thought I already got that one. So let's take a look back. All right, so we found them. So this is supposed to be, I believe that's supposed to be a variation. And so looking at the backs of the cards, it, the name variation is on the back. The fronts are exactly the same other than just a slight color. The, uh, the originals, the, the short or the variation is, is a much brighter image. And so after looking, I was like, what the heck? What's different about it? And then uh, all I could find different was that it says the South Side. All right. So that's that. That's the variation. That's what you got to look for. Uh, multiple things. Anthony K. He's pitching well, I believe. All right. Francisco Lindor. Vector, Vector Red. I mean, they are tiny cards. And we got a Vladimir Guerrero, Vector Red, Diamond King. And then we got a, one of the Bash Brothers, Jose Canseco. And then we got a Garrett Cole Dominators with the squares. Sharp looking card though. All right, and the last few we got Bobby Bradley. Abram Toro rookie card. Flip it around to see Jalen Davis rookie card. Jake Rogers rookie card. And the last one, Wade Boggs. All righty. Well, let's recap. All righty. So we've got a, quite a few different variations. Uh, the first couple uh, with the red on the back. Whoops, wrong one. With the red on the back, Vladimir Guerrero. So I wanted to show you that not only did they have name variations, but they also have uh, image variations. So these two, Paul Goldsmith and Vladimir Guerrero, are image variations. Then we have a couple of the blues that have the black ball. So as, as we look at those, uh, there's a name variation and an image variation on that one. And then we have all these are all uh, name variations. And then we have a team variation, which is the Eloy Jimenez. So those are the variations we got. We got... A whole bunch of rated rookies, which is always good. And I think the hit is the Bo Bichette rated rookie. And there's the back of that. And we got a Lou Rob rated rookie. And there's the back of Lou Rob. And then the super duper Whamabama is the Jordan Alvarez. Uh, the Rookies. And there's the back of that. So that was a fun rip. And we got a bunch of red vectors. Uh, those are nice looking cards. Didn't hit any big ones in there. So now what? All right. So now what? And if you still hung around to the end of the video here. Uh, what happened was we had a drawing, uh, Monday night and I drew this name out of my hat 
and this person did not collect their prize. So, I still have the original names in the hat there. And so, because the uh, winner did not claim their prize, let's try it again. So, we'll mix these all up. And I'll close it up, and I'll reach in, and I'll find one, and I'll pull it out. And the winner is Ground Zero. Ground Zero, you are next in line for the Panini Points. If you are interested in winning these Panini Points, go to the About tab in my YouTube channel, there in the description of what this channel is about. You will find my email. Email me, please, and give me your information, and I will mail these out to you. And so thank you, everybody, for participating. Uh, and if Ground Zero does not claim the prize by Friday, we will do another drawing until someone wins this wonderful prize from Panini. So, again, I appreciate the community. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, share this if uh, somebody asks, you know, what do you do at night? Or, you know, things like that. Hey, you got YouTube. Hey, we got baseball cards to look at. You know, that's what it's all about here. So, I appreciate your time. I appreciate you coming to check out my channel. Hang around. There's more to come. And if you look down below there, there's probably over 70 different videos, all different, of all different kinds of sports cards and sports card stories and history lessons and how to submit cards and cards that I got back from SGC and all kinds of stuff. So plenty of entertainment down there in Charlie's Cards. So I appreciate you looking. Check it out. Charlie's Cards, Lou Rob, over and out.